You know, I've been saying for a long time that Charles Darwin, Francis Galton, and the like were, I mean, they're, they're so criminal in their actions. Um, but beyond that, I've always contended that there's a heavy biblical essence to what they say. And even if you go from the aspect of Genesis chapter 1, verse 1 going down, you'll understand that the earth is covered in water and that the first forms of life do come out of the water. There is merit to the idea that life starts in the water, but that doesn't mean that all life came from the water. But a specific branch of life, type of life, did start in the water. They are the first. There are birds of the water. There are reptiles of the water. There are obviously the whales and the fish of the sea. Um, so when you when you listen to this idea or this notion, don't think that the idea of life starting in water is improper. Just know that all life did not start in the water per se, because there are animals of the land. There are birds of the land. You understand? Um, there are, there are, once again, there's, 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 there's different animals that there, there are reptiles of the land. There are beasts of the field. You see, um, all things that are established in good order. And then the man, however, so even if you look at it from an evolution point of view, there is the climax of all these animals, the same way that they explain evolution that does come into the creation of man. However, I won't get too carried away into this. Um, I just wanted this to be one of those things that I'm talking about going forward. And I'm going to slowly get back into the genetics. I'm going to tie it all together with the scripture. And I'm going to try to keep it with the book of Enoch. But I have to keep everything kind of separate. You know, uh, they're together, but they're different. However, uh, just look forward to things like this. I like it. I think it's different. Um, it's harder to contend what I'm saying when there's something to support what I'm saying. And whatever. We're not going to worry about that. Hope you enjoy it. And uh, take it serious. Think genetics. Think, think zygosity. Homozygosity. Dizygosity. Monozygosity. Right? Heterozygosity. Hemozygosity. Those type of things. Right? Think phenotype. Genotype. Think. Gene mutation. Okay? And when you all understand these things, then you come to seeing that one Gregor Mendel and the Mendelian theory or, 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 or thought process is one that actually comes from biblical precept as well, but he is an Augustinian monk and he doesn't hide his faith. However, these are things that we will go over again and again and again until it's appreciated. Good day.